We do have breaking news now, and Jeff Zucker has announced his immediate resignation as the president of CNN. This comes amid an investigation into what Jeff Zucker calls a consensual relationship with a colleague. Others are calling it inappropriate. Whatever it is or was, he's out. Joe Concha, you're watching this. Uh, yeah, about nine years ago, Jeff Zucker came to CNN. It was a left of center network, yes, but a legitimate news organization. I used to go on, uh, go on uh, pretty often at that time. And, and when you're looking at the book on Jeff Zucker, his legacy will be taking this news organization and making it a blatantly active uh, organization uh, geared to target conservatives. Obviously, when Donald Trump came on board, then they led the resistance uh, against him, and it really hurt their reputation. Uh, now you see that their uh, ratings, when you compare it to the same month last year, are down 90 percent. So uh, business, not very good. But let's read the statement from Jeff Zucker. He said, as part of investigation, the investigation, excuse me, into Chris Cuomo's tenure at CNN, I was asked about a consensual relationship with my closest colleague, mm. someone I have worked with for more than 20 years. I acknowledge the relationship evolved in recent years. I was required to disclose it uh, when it began, but I didn't. I was wrong. That relationship was with Allison Gullis. She is the chief marketing officer for CNN. Uh, Zucker uh, was um, divorced uh, just a couple of years ago. But you have to wonder if there's more to this story. It, why resign well, if you're having a consensual relationship this with a colleague? Part stands I guess out to me. Yeah. As part of the investigation into Chris Cuomo's tenure at CNN. Now, you talk about their ratings and who's left. It was my yeah. understanding, Chris Cuomo, I, I mean, I didn't watch him, but a lot of people did. On that network, it was boosting their primetime numbers at the time. Something tied up in that investigation then took down this guy. That's two people. The investigation's still ongoing. Uh, Joe Concha, indeed, the question is, what is behind the scenes in terms of that investigation that's going on? Because for him to mention it here, it, it tells me that, you know, it wasn't just a simple matter that he didn't tell people that he was dating this woman. It was that it's mixed up in an investigation where they're taking a look at improprietous behavior by one of his employees. And so we will yeah. have to see what happens with that.